All right, let's connect and talk about The Rock. Yeah, you know, Dwayne Johnson, because he really does rock. Yeah, that's right. He was honored last night with the People's Champion Award at the People's Choice Awards, and then he gave it away. I want to give you this. <laughs> because you represent everything that it means to be a people's champion, so this is for you. Mmm, I love The Rock. So that girl was attending the ceremony thanks to the Make-A-Wish Foundation, and she was shocked, even with the mask on, you can tell how shocked she was. The Rock says he met the girl earlier and was just floored by her story and felt like she deserved the award because of what she's done, literally fighting for her life. We love The Rock. I know. What a stand-up guy. He really is. And you just can just tell. Something he didn't need to do. Yeah. She was probably thrilled just to even meet him. Yeah. You know, and then he gave her the award. That's the cherry on top. Yeah. So sweet. Okay, now to a, a crazy story from Texas where a substitute teacher sat his class down for a little karaoke. Take a listen. I'm addicted to you. Don't you know that you're toxic? Okay, team, you know what song that is. It was his version of Toxic by Britney Spears. He was substituting a class and just waltzed in with his karaoke machine from home, dimmed the lights, and broke out in song. He was quickly asked to leave after <laughs> this performance. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure his class loved it, but maybe the bosses at the school were... Someone alerted the principal? Oh, I guess so. I think what's the big deal? I mean, if you're doing that all day, you know, it's yeah. like we're going to sing karaoke today versus yeah. just making an entrance. Yeah, this was the as entertainment a sub, you know? section of class. Yeah. <laughs> Usually it's the students who get busted when the sub's there, but now it's the wow. sub who's busted. Wow. Sometimes the tables turn. Yeah. That is quite, and I mean, really creating the environment, it's almost like there's a disco ball. It's a great there. learning yeah. environment. Yeah. 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 <laughs> exactly. So maybe don't try this if you're substituting a class. If you want to stay there, of course. Yeah, if you want the job all day. Yeah, exactly. Alrighty, let's take a look at today's poll. We've asked you at home, have you started wrapping holiday gifts? And we're asking this because producer Nick is starting to wrap his gifts today. Three quarters of Utahns are like, oh no, not ready for that yet. 25% are ahead of the game. Um, I've heard Dan's a great rapper, so he's offering to wrap your gifts at home. You know, <laughs> you I don't them. always like to do it because I'm kind of a perfectionist, which drives me crazy, you oh, know, yeah, so I have to like tuck the corners and it takes me a little longer than some because, yeah. you know, and it's like you can't use too much tape either. You know what cures like, that? You know, just save all your presents till Christmas Eve. You'll you'll and start then wrap wrap, and then yeah. you gotta hustle. You won't even care. No. Yeah. I've done that. You don't care. You just do it. Yeah. Slap some tape on. But we've got all of ours wrapped pretty much and under the tree. That's what gets everybody excited is presents under the tree That's instead of like true. showing up, you know, Christmas morning. But every family has their own tradition. Exactly. You know. So it's if all you good. don't want to wrap today, you wrap on Christmas Eve like Carrie and I. <laughs> <laughs> and you you ladies are so it. fun. Thanks, Danny.